Dubai, a place of rapid ascent from unimportant fishing village on the Persian Gulf to the building boom city of the 21st century. The construction industry in the United Arab Emirates is today increasingly in a period of change, moving away from the pure pursuit of superlatives like higher, faster and bigger, and towards a sustainable approach aimed at building in a better, long-lasting and energy-efficient way. BASF is on-site in the Gulf with production, sales and technical support and as a 24-7 solutions provider makes an important contribution to covering the growing need for solutions related to all aspects of sustainable construction. For Sheikh Sultan Al Qasimi, chairman and CEO of Gulf Holdings, the basis for sustainable construction is above all technical innovation. We have achieved a lot in the in the UAE and as we are in Dubai now you can see a lot of uh, innovative planning and construction based on the technologies and innovations with somebody else like one of my big partners BSF now these companies contribute to our success by contributing with their innovation and technologies innovation needs freedom and this country offer freedom. We are able to test and implement uh, and create greener and, and more efficient uh, units in our society. The above ground section of the new Dubai Metro, one of the most prestigious construction projects in the Emirates and also a key investment in the city's sustainable transport infrastructure. Rama Morthy Venkatesh is one of BASF's key account managers responsible for the metro project. The metro project uh, is a 24-hour project. Some of the jobs uh, like metro, we go at about past midnight, 12 o'clock, and we work till about 3, 4 in the morning as well. Uh, this uh, aspect of working 24-7, that is 24 hours all seven days a week, is a very common feature in Dubai. The track is being built segment by segment. The prefabricated segments are wedged together and then firmly stuck to each other at the joints using concresive, a special adhesive formulation. The adhesive that joins together the individual concrete parts must meet tough specifications. It's got to remain in a consistent, usable state, even in the arid Emirates extreme climatic conditions, and the joints must withstand the strong vibrations from the moving trains. This epoxy has been designed for the, for the project by BASF and we've been working since two years with this product and we found that the characteristic, the quality and the texture is very good for applying with hand because the texture of the product has to be uh, sticky to stay on the segment and not to fall and, and also soft because the, the, the workers are applying with hand. This product, it matches all the characteristics that we, that we require. 11,400 precast concrete parts will in future form the track of Dubai's new metro, the world's longest driverless local public transport system. From the Dubai metro to the world's tallest building, the Burj Dubai. Its construction was only possible at all thanks to BASF know-how. One of the numerous challenges facing the BASF chemicals experts was to modify the concrete in such a way that when pumped up to this extreme height, the mix didn't separate. For the Burj Dubai, the challenge was to have a concrete mix which can be pumped 600 meters vertically in one go. And obviously, to provide these properties to the concrete, we had to supply the right admixtures. And that was Glenium Sky 504. And these admixtures gave the required properties, so that means a long workability over three hours and as well the early strength development. Using Glenium Sky, the concrete sets more quickly. The next story can thus be built sooner and overall building time is shorter. The greater strength of the concrete also allows the building to be utilized longer, thus making it more sustainable. Being built not far from the Burj Dubai is the East Hotel. This new luxury hotel stands out above all for its energy efficiency. That's because the building's cladding with a new form of insulation system reduces the amount of energy used to cool the luxury hotel by 50%. BASF sales manager Julian Pritchard inspects the application of the EVE system on site with the contractor. 
EVE stands for Exterior Insulating and Finishing System. Basically, all EVE consists of is an air weather barrier that is applied to the facade, an expanded polystyrene board, base coat mesh, top coat, and we can make it look and design it so it looks like precast, or luco cladding, or whatever texture design the consultant would like. Belhaza's specialists mount the individual layers of the EVE system on the building's outer skin. Each of them has acquired the skills for the optimum way to work with the system in special training sessions. Well, the most important thing when it comes to applying the BSF EVE system is to do it correctly the first time. Because if you're talking about not doing it correctly, you're talking about repairs, and repairs are expensive. BSF have professionally arranged a complete training session for our applicators in their own workshops. In addition to that, we have the technical support from BASF coming onto site and correcting us in the small bits and pieces, and we have an ongoing learning process on site. In addition to great potential for saving energy, EVES also offers a broad spectrum of architectural design options in form, color, and texture. Two hours drive to the southwest in the Emirate of Abu Dhabi. The desert appears still untouched, yet it's precisely here that a globally unique city is being created, Mazdar, in Arabic, the source. This carbon neutral city of science will power itself with renewable energy. On the Mazdar stand at the World Future Energy Summit in Abu Dhabi, detailed models of the project give an insight into the future of the city. Khalid Awad, property development director of Mazda, presents the project to visitors and is hoping to find the right partners for this city of the future. We want BASF to, and I think it's already in BASF strategy, to work in developing cities like this. We want from BASF to bring all their knowledge and the different expertise that they have, you know, in building materials and insulation. You have a range of things that you can help us with. Help us build something like this, because if you build it together, then we can do 100 times like this. The whole world can learn from this example. The summit's central focus is on the new imperative for green construction and sustainable planning. BASF already offers right now numerous solutions for the construction industry to achieve this goal. BASF, the chemical company.